Hello and welcome guys, this is Berserker and welcome to another city building game called Tropico Where we get to be a dictator or not really be a bad dictator and be a really good one and help people or whatever It's another go at it, I've had it for since the beginning it came out but I never really got around to playing it So let's start playing it now Now I've checked it out a little bit and, and, and um, been going around it I've played Tropico 3 but never the other ones so I hear this game, all it does is really just keep on improving, and that's why I saw the trailers and shit, I was like, I want this game so bad, and I got it. But instead of going to Sandbox, which is like an open building thing, I suppose we could try out the campaign first to get really, to get into the game, get to know the game a bit more better. I've tried a tutorial and stuff and tried a little bit of the campaign at the beginning, so I know a little bit of what I'm doing. And actually, I just know shit about what I'm doing. So just get ready to abort, to get all aboard that fucking fail train again. So the first one is changing the world and get dynasty. And I hope I can get one of those awesome beards. Garcia, no. Our dynasty will be called Cut Berserker. A dynasty that will shoot missiles in the air. Yeah. Kim Jong Il. Oh god. Okay, that was pretty. Okay, so you get to customize your make your Raphael Berserker, really? Okay. Um, let's just make him Caucasian because face it, we're Caucasian. And give him the badass face. This is just basically just you know customization of your character. Most important thing here is really the skill, but I don't want to be called Raphael. Actually. Let's see what they have. Raimundo. <laughs> Jesus! Can it be called like Jesus? Wow, that would be fucking awesome. The Church of Burkfield coming to a new location there. Fabio Fabian We're going with Fabian Berserker here because fuck it. That's like, you know my name. I was really going for that and I wasn't really sure so oh god I'm doing this. Alright, so this is also it. Um the skills is the most important thing, what you think. So the decks hidden rolls and drop code twenty percent faster. Uh converts to votes for cheating on elections. The altruist is for two thousand bonus starting money. 480 is increased by 10% with celebrity. Cheap scale is all constructions are 4% cheaper. Environment is reducing the pollution. The financier gains 200 more. Big ones for annual income. Foreman is global effectiveness of production buildings is increased by 2. And general is for the officers. Administrator is also service buildings constructions costs decreased by 10%. So I don't really know. Administrator is pretty cool. General is not really my kind of thing. Cheapskate might be my kind of thing though to build cheaper shit though Maybe getting the help from foreign aid would be fucking awesome too. So let's go with that one So right, mr. Dictator I kind of look at this you can be an astronaut you can be like a greaser If you like, you know, you got a lot of you got a afro you got the undercut and stuff like that You can even be like a hipster if you want to be but It's not like the good old hobo look with like a like this it makes you kind of look like the dude from um, Sons of Anarchy, the research dude from oh, was season five or four. I don't even fucking remember. Holy god! Main color champagne. Well, yeah, that shows us to be rich. I don't like. No, no, not Birdo dark brown. Oh, black really. Black as a nut. Coconut white. Kind of looks. I like it this way already. Just give him like. Because there's no monocle. I was really hoping there would be a monocle in this game, but there's no fucking monocle! Get a monocle in this game to make me the ultimate dictator. I would have gone for the dictator suit, but no, no monocle, no fucking thing. I mean, you could get a hat too. Like a funnel, like a captain's hat, like a. Oh, Inquisitor's hat. Some headphones if you want to be like with a beanie. A fez. But look at this cylinder. It's actually a top hat. Look at that. Doesn't that fit this costume perfectly? Yes, it does. There we go. Alright. You know those people who established dynasties so powerful that their names echo through the centuries? 
I'm one of them. New world, new opportunities, no limits. This island of mine could become anything. It could be a farmer's heaven, the fields reaching the horizon, and the markets full of people. Could be. Some good beef. Or oh, llamas. You know, it would be wonderful if you could get some llamas, put some hats on them, get llamas with hats, and then let them take over the world. Have a little llama army, and that'd be awesome. I think it would. Or it could be the paradise on Earth. A llama army. A think about that. For travelers from I, I, I mean, you'd be like, what the fuck is going on? And they, because you don't know what's going on, you'd be getting like spat on, bitten, sir, and they would take over the world pretty fast. By confusion. But now, Let's just make sure that this is not our starting so island. I mean, it's just a clip there. Let's make it shine. There's like a guy walking there. Waving to the people. Oh, okay, so the first mission, you get to choose everything, economic difficulty and stuff like that. Well, let's just not change all this shit. Let's keep it at medium. It's pretty. So, mission is a new down and win your independence, which is actually the first mission. And um, there you go. To get past the first touch, you can go down Bao Bao, which is not that treeful. And then you can go on Kao Keo de Fortuna, which is more treeful. So, uh, let's go for the tree one. There you go. I've never even... Yeah. Ah, the Caribbean. A lush and untamed land. My new home. Beautiful and full of promise. A new beginning, far from the politics of the old world. A chance to start fresh and do things my way. I'm tired of the musty weather and rigid thinking back home. I need a change. I was appointed governor of this island. Not that anyone else wanted the job anyway. My unique approach to government will make this colony the most prosperous in the Caribbean. <laughs> How hard can it be? You just need some planks, a few nails, and a trusty advisor to shout at. If only. If only. So here we go. A new town. Welcome to the Caribbean. This is Lord Oxford. Allow me to introduce myself, Lord Oaksworth, His percentage. Majesty's Emissary to up. the region. Okay, so here we are at our little island. Not the point is we get we have to get this happiness up to fifty one percent with the support. I mean the revolution support. We only got three supporters, so and also we need to get this crown to be neutral or warm so they can give us more shit. But it's kind of a bit difficult. And most importantly, how to get to that, uh, um, shit, which button was it? This popular support is also by increasing the happiness and stuff like that. And then we're gonna get there. Don't worry, we'll be there. And then, uh, we'll take on our uh, first little mission, which is she's gonna offer us some packages. There you go. Chap, have I got Greetings, a deal for older you chap. Today. As crown representative, I can offer you your very own trading license. So, I can start you off with the silver package that includes the trading licenses and free trade ship. However, for a man such as yourself, I have to recommend a platinum package that includes all features of the silver package, as well as not one, not two, but three special trade offers to start you off. So you automatically unlock one free trade ship. So if you buy, if you like already go for like the Dutch, which is the cheapest one, you already get less crown relationships. Let's not do that. Let's just go for the silver pack. But let's be honest, we're not stupid. We're not going to get ourselves ripped off and get 4,000 big ones gone out of our bank. Oaks are already, well, more Oak was already trying to rip us off. So let's just buy that silver package. Simple as that. Build it right there. There we go. Kind of in the negative right now, which isn't that good, I guess. But these, like, um, what do they call it again? These country houses will get us. Technological progress. Oh, now you know, you know she's asking it. Okay, there you go. We need more scientists to think important thoughts and discover new stuff. 